and we're here at uh, CES 2018. You can and uh, right here with Planet Computers, and the Jiminy PDA is uh, is working. Yes, here they are. So uh, we're launching today. So uh, this is the uh, Planet Computer Gemini. It's a 4G keyboard smartphone. So, so it has a, with a Debian. Yes, there's a Android 7.11 and Debian. Uh, so we're, we're, we have uh, Linux as well as Android uh, possibilities on the device. So and you can close, you can show how cool it yeah, is. Yeah, so it's closing and this is the final finish. So you can see it's kind of brushed, uh, brushed steel uh, with a... So it's the final finish. And, and this is the gyroscope logo? Or? This is the planet logo. You it's have gonna, a gyroscope inside? The, there is, there is, yeah, of course. So what is it for? So this is uh, basically the device itself. It's basically aimed at people who want to create, uh, people who want to uh, type on the move, uh, write emails, um, so write emails, uh, do blogging, uh, you know, essentially create, write documents, write books. How good the is move. the keyboard? I think the keyboard now, you, you, you take your own, uh, you know, you have to make your own judgment, but I think we've made some good, uh, you know, it's, it's, it feels like a real keyboard, like you can really press the keys. And, and you can even feel vibration on every time you type. Yes, you, you can get a sound and uh, vibration feedback, so that it makes you feel uh, more, uh, more comfortable. So I don't know if you can try, you, you can hear the sound. You can hear the sound maybe. Nice. And uh, I don't know if you can feel the, the feedback on that. Yeah, it feels really cool. You know, and so what, you what did you modify the, the keyboard for specifically? Uh, you know, uh, making a small keyboard is always tricky. So we had like uh, maybe even like five different iterations uh, to get to get to this to get this. Uh, so, uh, but uh, we're, we're we're quite happy now with the uh, the keyboard uh, function, and uh, you know, it's 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 really interesting to use shortcuts and uh, on a keyboard to do How does that work? keys. So, for example, I mean, one that probably is interesting for you when you need to take screenshots of different programs and so on. Function R will take a screenshot. Nice. So, very, very simple. If you need to in, uh, decrease the brightness, you just do nice. uh, the brightness increase or decrease. Same with the sound, to decrease the sound or increase the sound. Uh, if, we're, if we're going into, let's say, uh, playing a video, uh, let's say we'll, we'll go to YouTube and let's say we'll put a video. Uh, then this is going over 4G at the moment. Yeah, it's a busy uh, so, conference. So essentially, so here we'll put the sound on and then let's say we want to stop the video. So we'll do, we'll do stop and then we can continue. This a uh, rewind, fast forward. Yeah, you can go. This is full next. screen. No, that that no, that's uh, that's uh, screenshot. 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 Yeah. Uh, do you have also like a special UI functionality with like a, you're showing a bunch of uh, yeah. Charts? So there's a there's a little uh, there's a shortcut. You wow. Can go to an, you can put your own apps here. It's not fixed, but if I want to go to Word, I can go to Word and start writing a document. And then, at the same time, uh, so I can now write a document, and I can zoom as well here, to zoom. But at the same time, if I want to split screen and continue watching the video, I can do that as well. What do you think the guy in 1997 who was using a sign, if you told him that there would be a version with this, what do you think he would say? Well, personally, if I saw it, I would just buy it. But I was a sign user myself, so. But, uh, yeah, it's... It's exciting. I think it's going to be very exciting for all the sign users. It's the first time that something uh, very interesting is happening in the smartphone business, isn't it? Uh, it's a new form factor because since the iPad. It's uh, a new form factor. Consumption phones with no keyboards. Nobody's doing keyboards anymore. Yeah, it's Black it's, is bank, it's, it's the only down. real it's the only real keyboard like device now, and we try to make it as powerful as we can. So nice. So the multi window is working like this. Yes. And uh, yeah, you can you can then go back to anything that's running in the back as well. So uh, you can go into into the different apps there. Let me just close this. 
you can go through the YouTube, you can bring it up with a, with a keyboard as well, and you can press it again and play. And there's, uh, there's two uh, Type-C? Two Type-C. Type this side is for charging, PC yeah. connection, and uh, any hub connectivity. Yeah. So there's a here for what? Sorry. This is the what power charging, a yeah. USB-C hub, so you can do a hub, and uh, and also for PC connectivity. On the other side, you've got a USB-C for uh, external device like a mouse or a, um, some kind of a card, SD card or Display? USB. Yeah, and HDMI display. Is it display so, port or uh, display link? Or it's, do do? it's HDMI out. Direct HDMI? I'll show you. So there's a cable. HDMI. Oh, yeah, nice. HDMI cable? Really, really good. Yeah, no, no worries, yeah. Uh, I saw Jeff earlier as well. He came out with George. Oh, right. Yeah, cool. Yeah, yeah please. Cool. It's see event, okay. Right here. Yeah. Which one is the HDMI cable? Uh, I'm searching for it. No? No? Um, so I have another one. I'll take it. So, uh, can you show? Why, why, why is this off? What can you do? Can you uh, open it up? This is the tool. Yes, correct. Um, this is the tool. It's used to open uh, basically all the the, the part of the of the Gemini. Okay. Time with the unit, which probably is the, the unit. Whoa. So then you access the, so the hard drive. So you, uh, you access everything. So inside Whoa. you have uh, the SIM slot. Uh, so you have single SIM. Single SIM. Yeah. Single, single SIM, and yeah. there is also an e SIM. E SIM. Correct. Is that an international standard, the eSIM? It will be, yes, it's, it's, a, it's an international standard. Uh, needs to be configured with the op uh, mobile operator, so that will, uh, yeah. will be more standard in the future. Thanks. Uh, yes. uh, this <laughs> is uh, the SD card okay. slot. Okay. Uh, well, the card. Card. Uh, and this here is actually mark. quite interesting. Okay. This is, there is a space. So this That's is a new invention you made. This is, well, this is, <laughs> it's not an invention, but um, when we were developing the, the device, we had a number of people asking for an external camera. And basically, we left a little space uh, with a plug. So uh, is it only for cameras user, or is for everything? It's only for, this is only for cameras. You cannot connect like an e-ink display? No, no this, is, no, this is just for the camera. Just for camera. Uh, but the device itself is, um, designed to be modular so the idea is that uh, in the future these two parts can be detached and maybe uh, you know changed yes because one side uh, contains the keyboard and the battery and the other side contains the display and the uh, and, and the and the board but uh, so will the user be able to detach it or is only uh, no but they, they are easily detachable, so, um, so yeah, you can upgrade it's the actually, phone part and keep the same keyboard. Or? Please, um, tech, theoretically, um, yes. Technically, yes. Yeah, for sure. It's it's not it's not for the user, but it's very easy to detach. How the stable part. is this part here? Uh, this one is well, it's very stable. I mean, this is where the magic happens. You know, when you close it, uh, the hinge actually disappears and becomes so part of the case. And when you open, it, the it, it creates this yeah. little leg, so the device is stable. It's stable when you type? Yes. Nice. So how good is the keyboard? What, what did you uh, we think are, about when you... Uh, we are, we are, we are now keyboard. quite, quite satisfied with it. Uh, we went through several iterations. Um, different membrane, yeah. uh, stiffer, yeah. less stiff, and, and and different kind of plastics no, used for the for the keyboard. And uh, this is a HDMI adapter. So basically, it has a built-in HDMI output. Yes. It's not display port. It's not display uh, link. No, it's only HDMI. It's only HDMI. So, so, so is it is it HDMI a uh, 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 4K? No, it's, uh, it it's full HD, yes. Yeah. So it's a 1.3 or 1.4 HDMI version or something like that? 
uh, I guess so. It's, it's a normal, you know, you can connect then a normal, normal TV, uh, Full HD, uh, and you will see. This is uh, HDMI alt mode, right? Yes. As an alt mode, Type C for HDMI. Not alt mode. It's a um, uh, custom mode for the Gemini. Custom for Gemini. Yes. This is a unique Gemini cable. Yes. It's not on the market. Uh, Other people don't have this. Uh, it's uh, it's in the connectivity pack, I believe, and it will be sold as a separate accessory. It's not it's not expensive. And you can have a uh, one one screen on here, and your OS supports the second display on the second display. Uh, not at the moment. Not the moment. It's technically no, no, not at the moment. It uh, might be possible in the future, but it's, it's so right at the now moment. It's cloning the same. Exactly. Uh, but how about with the Debian? Then it will be Debian will be cloned on the on the screen. All right, that's awesome. It's working. So, uh, so, so, what's next? Um, uh, there's there's all the media is very very excited right now. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so, what's next? There's a lot of excitement. Well, uh, now we have to satisfy all our backers, and there are more and more contributions. So. Uh, of course, we're going to be producing the first units and sending them out this month. So, how many backers you had? You had over a million dollars. Yeah. So now Google, right? we now we have about uh, in terms of back back backing. You know, there's there's basically in terms of units, there's about uh, two thousand seven hundred and fifty units uh, that have been uh, ordered. So now we have to produce those units, and we're producing them right now. So it's that's very exciting to make, be able to do something where you don't need to have thirty thousand order, but you can do something with three thousand. You know, it's and challenging. Do something amazing like this. It's challenging, uh, you know, but uh, we have a limited budget, and we've done the best we can, I think. So I, I imagine it's been a big. Uh, a big adventure to work with your Chinese partner to get every step of the way and advance, advance, advance to something that works. You, you know, there, there are always challenges, but I think it's been a great relationship. Uh, and uh, I think we've, you know, we've, we've chosen the right partner. And I but think... They, uh, they must be very excited, right? To as, do something new like this. Yeah, and you know, as we're, as we're building up sales, hopefully they'll see uh, their investment, you know, in this also pay off in a good way. And building a keyboard is not too difficult for the factory? So the fact the keyboard it's our design, but it's actually built by a keyboard specialist, a company. Connected so in. it's a yes, yes. So it's actually uh, it's it's actually uh, but it, but it's completely our design. So in terms of they will have expertise in the tooling of keyboards, but it's completely our design in terms of the Mark uh, Martin Ridiford's design. Uh, he of course knows how the sound keyboard was working before we have made some changes and hopefully it's uh, going to please people. How much work is there left for Debian? Uh, more than on the Android uh, and of course we'll be putting the Debian uh, release on the, on the web. Uh, is it hardware accelerated we are committed we are committed to open source to what we can open source yeah so our, our things will be in open source. Is it uh, accelerated the GPU part? This is Mali, right? GPU. Uh, so it's a good question. We're working on that. I think we've seen some. Uh, I think Davide will know more, but I think we've seen some hardware acceleration already. Is there any other issues like uh, LTE? Can you? Oh, make lots that of work? L lots of lots of issues still. Debian, well, can have LTE? Lots of issues, but you know, uh, we we we're working on the mobile connectivity. It's not there yet. Wi-Fi is there. The screen is there. We have seen some hardware acceleration, but we don't know what's going to be in the final, final build. And and people will be able to download it and, and flash it in. Because if it's open source, maybe you can have some help from the open source community to finalize everything, right? Yes, yes. That that would be lovely. And I think you know, once we can release the unit with the uh, uh, the kernels and everything else, so that people can build things, that would be great. You should send some free devices to the best best hackers. I'm joking. Yes, it, yes, and uh, we, we've already sent yeah, out. We already sent out some uh, boards, you know, some uh, very early boards, but not really proper devices. So, really, the first proper devices from the production line have come out like uh, literally on Friday, and we have them here because Robin, our CEO, uh, flew in from China 
Friday night, we picked them up at the airport on Saturday, and we're here. Sunday now. Yes, amazing. Yeah. That's cool. So I guess there have been some sleepless nights in China. There have been some sleepless nights, full stop. Everywhere. In London as well. For the last 10 months? Uh, certainly in the last week, but there's been some other times when there were some sleepless nights too. And this is the biggest consumer electronics conference in the world right here. So there's a good chance that maybe you'll find uh, you, you will have, you'll meet some new distributors and they'll be like, hey, okay, we want 10,000 and we want 100,000 we want a million pieces. Uh, I think it's an, it's an, the, it's an, look, look at our stand. Uh, that's quite a good, uh, if you, if you, if you yeah. see, you know, it's, it's quite a, quite a crowd building up. So, you know, it's quite a crowd building up. So I think uh, people are, people are excited. I think it's much more exciting than the iPhone X. Yeah, well, iPhone X is like an iPhone. It's like an iPhone. So it's we've seen. Exciting. It's this is different. Cool.